What's up, everybody? Welcome back to another episode of Beer 30. I'm your beer host, Ernesto. I'm here back in action, and today we're in Eureka, California, ready to give you guys a mini tour of the Lost Coast Brewing Company. I hope you guys are excited. Let's go ahead and check it out. Welcome, everybody, to the Lost Coast Brewing Company. Lost Coast began as an experiment out of this 100-year-old building in the heart of downtown Eureka, back in the early era of craft beers and microbreweries here in California. As they grew in popularity, they would later expand into a custom-built brewery located on the south end of the city, where they continue to operate and consistently put out their amazing line of craft brews. With a place this huge, we found a spot to sit down and check out the menu and order our first round in no time. Okay, everybody, welcome to the inside of Lost Coast Brewing Company out here in Eureka, California. We're gonna go through the menu and choose the items that we're gonna go ahead and have and share with you guys today in just a second. Let's go ahead and dive into this. Let's go. To kick things off, we took our server's suggestion to order their famous buffalo wings, and that's something I'll never say no to. So of course, we gave them a whirl and let me tell you all, they aren't kidding when they say that these are legendary around these parts. They came out steaming hot. You could see the light crisp on the skin, just the right amount of buffalo sauce, leaving them glistening with that spicy goodness. I was practically drooling and could not wait for that first bite. Piece of deliciousness, I can't help myself. Definitely got to add this to your order. The wings are phenomenal. Juicy, crispy, a little spice. Definitely a little spicy. Nothing a little ranch camp help out with. So highly recommend to give these a try as well. Whew, I'm going to enjoy. All right, just got my meal in. It's the famous hot, something that they made up here. It's like a French dip. I'm super excited to try it. Let's go ahead and dive into it. Ladies and gentlemen, I bring you the Lost Coast's famous Hop Brown. A delectable sandwich comprised of mounds of tender roast beef, simmered in their famous downtown brown beer, layered with crispy hickory smoked bacon and cheddar cheese, topped with a rich ranch dressing on a soft sourdough roll. You do have the option to add the deep fried pickles, which I sadly forgot. I did, however, upgrade my fries to the seasoned fries, which was a surefire win here. Now the menu doesn't mention that the sando comes with an au jus dip, and I sure don't remember asking for it, but I highly, highly recommend to add it to the meal. I mean, the sandwich already was top notch, but the dip just cranked it up to 11, for sure. This meal comes with the recommendation to pair it with their eight ball stout, which I sure did, and let me tell you folks, this pairing was magical. Weighing in at a delightful ABV of 5.8%, this deep brown oatmeal stout is known to be bold and robust in flavor packing a creamy oatmeal smoothness with an intoxicatingly sweet aroma. Every sip is a rewarding experience, with a rich palate of roasted malts and heavy hops, and a delicious caramel finish. The 8-Ball is definitely an example of what a stout can and should be. This is a perfect match to a hearty meal. Make sure to get the seasoned fries. So just got myself the beer that I wanted to share with you guys today. This is called the Fog Cutter. Let's go ahead and dive into it. Cheers. For all you hop heads out there, this one goes out to you. On today's beer menu, we bring you the delicious Fog Cutter IPA. This is the Lost Coast's first true double IPA. With a beefy ABV of 8.7%, prepare your taste buds for a wild ride. For the Fog Cutter is a delightful blend of bitter flavor by design and yet masterfully balanced with a variety of malts. It's a beautiful golden brew that presents a bright citrus nose derived from a myriad of extra dry hops including Cascade, Centennial, Crystal, and Chinook hops, giving this beer its refreshing effervescence that you'll enjoy to the very last drop. All right, getting into the Fog Cutter. This beer is amazing. Highly recommend to put this on your beer bucket list. Come on in to Lost Coast Brewing Company and give it a whirl. You will not be disappointed. Cheers. All right, everybody, I really hope you guys enjoyed exploring 
Bosco's Brewing Company out here in Eureka, California with us today. Definitely try their wings. They're known for their wings. They're amazing. Spicy, crispy, juicy, all the things you want in wings. Highly recommend to give those a whirl. And the hot brown was an amazing sandwich. Definitely want to pair it with their eight ball stout. It is an amazing pairing. Highly recommend to do that. And last but not least, the fog cutter was an amazing double IPA. If you're into double IPAs or IPAs in general, clean, crisp, everything you want in an IPA. Highly recommend it. It's definitely balanced and amazing. So anyways, thank you guys for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Hit the little notification bell. And I hope to see you guys on the next adventure video, next brewery. Until then, happy trails and happy drinking. Catch you on the next one. Cheers. The wings, phenomenal, top notch. Definitely live up to the legend. These are amazing. Get yourself a pair of wings. Get yourselves an order of wings and enjoy. Trust me, these are amazing. Just the right amount of spice, just the right texture, juicy, crispy, all the things. Highly recommend.